Hey everyone, I'm Brando. Welcome to my YouTube channel. It's my very... Say, Kyla, come here. Come here. This is Kyla. And uh, since we're all under quarantine right now, I figured it was finally a... Continue. I figured it was finally an opportunity for her to finally learn how to play magic because she hasn't really had a whole lot of interest. But you know, since we're under lockdown and we don't have a whole lot to do, um, she finally agreed to learn. So we figured we would record our very first game together and we would broadcast on the internet for all of you to see. Aren't you excited? She's so excited. Okay, good. Okay. Hey everybody. So we're at the thing now. Kyle's got my Kirsten Zern Gibble playmat. It's my other favorite playmat after my CCO playmat. There's a few still available at Commander Cookout Podcast. At commandercookout.com slash store if you want to buy one. Yeah, anyway. So, today I'm going to play Nor and the Wary because I'm going stir crazy and I need to play this. And I got Kyla uh, Gissa. It's a zombie F your hand discard deck. She doesn't know what any of that means, but we're going to learn some magic right now. It's going to be awesome. Okay, first things first, we draw seven cards. Okay. One. Do I have to have them in order? No. No, okay. as long as I can't see them. Two, three, That's what's important. Four, Ooh. Five, six. That's not good shit is what that is. Okay. I'll go first to show you how it's done, okay? Okay. Observe. Mountain. You tap the mountain to make mana for mountains. I'm going to play Nor and the Wary. I didn't understand anything you just said, but okay. See, he goes away and comes back whenever you attack or play a spell. Flips over like this. See, it's altered on the back by Ryan from Planet Podcast. New altars every Thursday on our Facebook page. Why don't you hold them up close like this? Because last time oh, I... I showed you my card. Does, can I draw a new card? Yes. Last time I did that, everything went all crazy. Okay, so now it's your turn. Okay, but don't look at the card. I'm going to show them. Okay. See, you do it up close. I don't know if that works. Anyway, okay. I'm sure it does. So now it's your turn. So you, you've okay. drawn a card. Okay. You so can play one land per turn. Your lands will be swamps. So the card will say swamp at the top of the card. Okay, do you have a swamp? No, do you? Yeah, but I want you... Oh, it's not that kind of game. Okay. No, yeah. So I put a thing. Yeah, you put the swamp down. It's the other way, though. You gotta make it stand up. There you go. It's only laying down when you use it. No, you know what I mean. Well, how... Stand up. Like this? Yeah, there oh. you go. There you go. You got it. You're figuring it out. That's cool. And then if you have something that has one skeleton head at the top, you can make it lay down like mine, and then you can play a skeleton head thing. What if I have one that has seven skeleton heads? Then you need seven swamps. Oh. Okay, just wait. I'm not good at counting. Okay, I may or may not have cards that have one skeleton head, so now do, what do I do? Do they have another, like, number next to them? Or is it just a skeleton head? Well, I can't tell you because then you'll use that to your advantage. Let's put strategy. It's like he's never played before. If okay. You, Okay, if you have something that has one skeleton head at the top and yeah. no number next to it, yeah. you can lay this down and then put that card on the table. Okay, and what if I don't? Then you then it's my turn. Okay, it's your turn. Okay. Big money, big money. <laughs> okay. 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 So I'm gonna make another mountain. Okay. Is that Monet on your back of your cards? Manet? Monet? I think so. Rembrandt? It's a little dragon guy. He's like Look over there so you can't see my card. And he's like, It doesn't matter if I can see it. I don't know what the cards are. Well, we don't know that. You might have been practicing in the spare time. We don't know what you've been up to. You're sketchy as hell. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. I'm going to play a Sol Ring. Sol Ring makes two mana and it is really strong. It's you really have that card. on one of your mats. I do. I have them on one of my mats. So I'm going to make two magics with it, okay? Okay. okay. And I'm going to use one of those magics to play this mana ball. Okay. okay I can sure. tap it to make three magics. I have one magic left. I'm not going to use any of them. I'm going to play this mana crypt. Okay. I can tap it to make two magics too. Uh-huh. Okay. So I'm going to use the one magic that I have left. I'm going to play this grindstone. Okay. I'll tell you what that does in a second. You All could right. be totally just doing whatever the hell you want because I have no idea what's going on. Or do I? Well, I hope you do because that's going to make this way more impressive. I'm going to make two more magics. I'm going to play this Painter's Sermon. And now, 
all the cards everywhere are white. Like in your hand, and in my hand, and in your deck, and in your graveyard, and in play, they're all white. Is that a racism? No, that's not a racism, that's a color of magic. We're just not playing white because white sucks. Okay, I'm sure. Okay, so now I'm going to make three magics with this mana vault, and then I'm going to use grindstone on you, and you have to put the top two cards Grindo, up here. Grindstone, not in front of the kids. It's, bonus doesn't count. Oh. So you've got to put the top two cards of your library into your graveyard. We'll move it over here. There you go. So upside, so I can see them. Oh. And if they're both white, you have to do it again. Okay, so Liliana, Death's Majesty, I don't know what her race is, and Swamp, and I don't think it has a race because it's a land It's thing. not a race thing. It's a color thing. And they're both white because I have a painter's servant, so you have to do it again. I don't know what... Okay, so, so I, I do go two, two, more. two more again. And I do them here? No, you just put them in a pile like this. Oh. There, because this, okay. this is your discard pile. And those are both white too, so do it again. What is this? How do you know they're white? Because I made them white with painter's servant. Okay, so here's okay. two more. Those are both white. Here's my foot in when I was in Mexico. Oh. Both white. Keep going. You have to keep going until you get two cards that don't share a color. Do you see a pattern here? No. Sweet. Okay, keep going. Just keep going until we run into a not white card. This is awesome. You looked away. Like, do you know? Oh, they're definitely all white because they're Did all white. Did you plan this? No, I just drew into this hand totally spontaneously. I don't these are all white. That guy's white. Okay, stuff's falling apart here. Hang on. Hang on. That's purple. Now it's white, though. Okay. I think you just gave me the trash you used to trade. No, I definitely didn't. It's all white stuff. Is this a dirty card? No, it's not dirty. Oh, okay. It's an alien telling somebody to discard cards. Wait a minute. Also white. Oh, I got a Solren. Definitely white. It's the whitest card you've ever but seen. But I'm running out of cards here. I know. What about the Midnight Reaper? He looks pretty... He's under the hood? White. Yeah. This is... Do people like watching this? I'll cut it in the middle. Do people tune in for this? Definitely. People have to learn magic somehow, Kyla. Why don't I just do it like this? Well, in theory, as I'm sure you've noticed the pattern, you could just take the whole pile and flip it upside down and put it right here. Uh, being facetious. No, because that's where it's going to go, because all those cards are white. So they all share a color, right? So you gave me all shit cards. No, they're just all white. So there. am I dead? So now... But I still have these cards. If when you start a turn and you go to draw a card from your library, um, you don't have a card to draw, so you lose. So I'm dead. Yeah. Why the fuck did we do this? You gave me all shit cards, and I could be, like, cross-stitching right now or picking my nose, and it would be better time spent. What about this card? Where did this one come from? I don't know. Is this white? Yep. Go, go fuck yourself. So that was it. Kyla's very first magic game. That was super fun. No. You didn't have fun? No, I don't even want to stand by you. I had lots of good fun, and I have Urs. Look, 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 look. There she is. That's big Urs. She's my dog. She smells a little bit because she got wet. She got a bath. She's, she's fine. Gross. So anyway, COVID-19, Kyla's very first magic game. She obviously had way more fun than she thought. She really liked that. Because everybody loves getting painter's grindstone, right? Not in front of the kids. Ha! Uh, don't Google that, I guess? So anyway, thanks for being here. Like, share, and subscribe if you want to see more videos just like this. Maybe Kyla will let me teach her how to play some actual magic at some point. Who can say?